Hey guys, Peter Miller here from Mercury Marine, and today we're gonna to be cooking mahi-mahi fingers, which is also known as dolphin fish. A lot of people often ask that question. First, you wanna score each piece and make them perfect size fingers. You wanna keep them all uniform. And if you really want to, you see a little bloodline on there, you don't like it, I don't care for it. I like to just cut that off. It's a very, very simple recipe, and that's why I like to do this for the kids. I've been doing it since, you know, back in 2000, probably is when I first started doing it. You're basically going to be taking eggs, cracking them, and putting them in a bowl, put a little milk in there, then I forgot seasoned breadcrumbs, and we're going to dip them in the eggs, then in the breadcrumbs, and then put them in a pan with butter. Next up. We have broccoli, which is pretty simple. You can cut it however you like. I basically pull them off. I kind of like uniform pieces when it comes to this, just like the mahi fingers. And when we get down to this part, it's kind of hard to do that, so I'll cut off the ends. Some people like the ends. I prefer to kind of get rid of them. And it's almost time to start cooking. And then I have a couple pats of butter in the pan. I got the rice cooking over here. I got the water getting ready to boil for the broccoli. And I like to get the pan warm. It doesn't have to be blazing hot. You definitely want the butter to start bubbling. It's about to start bubbling right there. That is when I start taking my fish. And if you want to, if you want to go ham, you can kind of put, put them all in at once and then arrange them. That's a nice way to do it. You don't want to put too much in the pan either. I like to coat them. You can hear that sizzle going. That's the butter, of course. Everybody likes butter. Even if you're on a diet, you will cheat and you will eat these. Get our rice going. We've got our water getting ready to boil for our broccoli. And while we wait, we kind of manipulate the fish. The key to this is what I like to do is I'll watch this pinkish, kind of opaque meat, the color come up white about halfway up each side. And that's when I know it's time to flip it. But the goal really is to have them this color. This is the color. You don't want them burnt. You don't want them, you know, black. This golden brown is where it's at. Now, if you don't want to burn it, you got to walk away from the pan for a minute. You can lower it to simmer and put the lid on it for about one minute. And this is the perfect time to take the broccoli and these boil in about three minutes. As soon as they turn bright green, they're good to go. All right, well, there you have it. There's some fish fingers. Then we're going to plate them over on my fish plate. The plating of the food's always nice to see and also the tasting of the food. Got to carve up, butter up, carve up, and then we're ready to go. Let's see, a little bit of rice, a little bit of finger. Perfect, there you have it. Fish fingers with rice and broccoli.